Um, Felix, at the same. Show me the one answer. Nice, baby. I will call. Yes. Um, I can say a full season at the end of Italy. How will you rate the season of our criminals? It was a very tough season for me, like, yeah, very, very tough. Because I couldn't meet like yeah my targets yeah how I planned to face it I couldn't get it that way so yeah it was very very tough for me. But my heart the target I was setting out because it's difficult for a player to say my certain target met me. So what did you want to? You achieve? know like everyone has his or her you know goals like for the season and mine was to be part of the top scorers so or to like get some number of goals you know but. Unfortunately, like couldn't uh, it couldn't happen, you know? Yes, yeah, so it was very very tough. Right, but um, being tough, or not, would you say say it's because of the movements from Roma? Well, I wouldn't say that though, but you know, in life things happen like this, you know. So yeah, I guess it's one of them. Yes. Um, a lot of people got to know you not because you played in Italy, but because of the manner who moved from Ghana to Italy. The story was widely published. Would you say that was a miracle? Not really, but I would say it was hard work and you know prayers. You know, yeah, because it's not easy to move from here to make it uh, big in Europe. Yes, yeah, so I would say. It was uh, God's grace, you know, yeah, and hard work. Yeah. yeah, so what was the most difficult thing when you got to Italy? Because, and yes, it was once, so, I was one, so, at the end of the month, I got a year to in my initial. I would say it's the language, you know, because I'm a Ghanaian, I don't know anything about Italy, so, I went there, people were saying, talking like, you know, they were saying, like, you know, they were talking their language, so I couldn't understand anything, so, yeah, I guess that's the, only challenge I had there, yeah. yeah. But you know, at the Roma Junior side, the goals were coming a lot of times. They say, Washego, a new player, Fina Washego. At the end, I push you, say, I say, the man now Bobo was too deep. Because me, a guy near, like, young player, I'm a free account, so like, I need to work hard, extra harder than, you know, the, than the whites. To you know, get you know, contract you know, yeah, yeah. to be someone successful in future. So uh, like, I have to work more, work extra, bank in the goal. So yeah. yeah. So how was the news broken to you? Said so you are going to the Roma first team because all of us were shocked. Yeah, it was a day before game. My agent called me. Hey Felix, you know something? I said no. Was it? He said like, if you score this game. You are going to face team, you know. I said, wow, face team. Okay, then let's see after the game. And that game, like, God being so good, I scored two. So then that was the um, day I went to the first team, yeah. Yeah, I understand. So now, Josie Ebeshemo, you team. I don't know whether you saw him before. Now, what was it? How did you feel seeing him to come watching the junior team? You know, like, you know with the blacks, when we see white, you know. You try to do like something, you know, work, work more harder, you know. So I was working hard. It was like, so after the training, like he, he tapped my shoulder. I said, Ben, I said, yeah, yeah, Ben. I said, okay, see you tomorrow. I said, okay. I was very, very happy. So I was with my friends. They said, hey, Felix, Afina, you touched Mourinho, Mourinho talked to you. I said, yeah, bro. I'm, okay, you so know. you touched you and not yeah. the other guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. You talked to Mourinho, you talked to Mourinho. I said, yeah, bro, yeah, bro, yeah. So that was it, yeah. That was great. So the first team, yeah, 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 put you to you who, who play as BTC, Tabi Abraham, Chris Small, and all the top guys you've seen on TV. First day of training. Before that, when Tammy, uh, Tammy arrived to Roma, he was training alone, so I went to like hide somewhere to make video of him. The day I met him, I like the same pitch. I was like, God, thank you. And I spoke to him, said, Tammy, like, yeah, I'm happy to see you. You were like my role model, and it was like, oh, yeah, I should keep it up. You have been seeing me, like, uh, been watching my training, so I should keep it up. I'll be, like, great. And I said, okay, thank you, bro. So I was very, very happy, yeah. Right. But what's the difference between the city, Rome, and then Cremonese? 
what was the difference in terms of team and then yeah, the city yeah. like you know Rome is a big city yeah, yeah. as compared to Cremona Cremona is not bad though but Roma is Roma yeah it's a big city very big you can find everything you want there not like Cremona but Cremona is also fine yeah so there are a lot of people who think that you are the future not only at club even at national team but you want to Cremona you said a lot of things difficult because now you are picking up the team is in uh, Syria B do you think it's a, an opportunity because as a player you find an opportunity in anything among for whom is a disadvantage do you think the Syria B will be an opportunity for you to just set up your target and hit back and now I say you'll be looking at other options um, opportunity yeah, no I won't say that way because people know me already like they know what I can do so I don't see like the opportunity. Opportunity you know? as in time to come back stronger. Uh, well, we will see, you know. We will see next season. Yeah. Yeah. I can't tell now, yeah? Right. Uh, but you know, when it comes to Ghana, we saw you first and foremost when Otoado came to the uh, Chorik Moreno at Roma to see pictures circulating then hey Afena will come to the national team but even before that it was a game against Genoa right yeah. and uh, you scored two goals how did you feel that night because I think uh, in Ghana everywhere I couldn't sleep your phone like my phone let's put the phone aside myself you know yeah, the feeling oh god I wish I had this back <laughs> again I couldn't sleep yeah, my mom called me she was crying she walked from our place we were still at get fun yeah she walked from there to run about barefooted uh, where is Sunyane get yes yeah, Sunyane yeah my mom yeah she walked run yes probably run about yeah. later they t like someone asked her, who are you that going night. yeah that night me I stayed at get fun I can't walk on that road in there she night. walked the night without phone so like you know imagine it my feeling, mom yeah. Yeah. yeah 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 so it was very very deep yeah but when you were coming into the game, like 15 minutes to the end of the game, no. what, what did Mourinho no, That was my second game, yeah, yeah. Second my game. second game. So like I had this in mind, like any minute I get from there, you know, Mourinho is good coach, big, uh, I'm playing with big players. Yeah. So I need to like do something, you know, for them to see yeah, these boys, you know, you got to like have something. Yeah. So yeah, that was it. So the next day you got your shoes from Mourinho. Osha and I, you have to frame that shoe because it's the most popular shoe. I don't wear anyhow. You, know? you don't wear anyhow. No. <laughs> for where? Especially out. But you are going for. Maybe for team yeah. dinner. Okay. Like, not every dinner, you know, like top dinner, you know. I wear. After that, I clean. It, you I have to it. frame it for your kids. For sure, yeah. I'm not sure it's a Obesha Debia. No. But was it true? Is that what country and said this is your favorite shoe? Or he just. You know, like. Um, I used to wear some for training, you know, yeah. and like, yeah, he noticed that yeah, I like the shoes and he bought them for me, so yeah, I was very, very happy. Yeah. Right, but uh, it's always, always a special feel. Even colleague footballers in Europe were sharing the videos, oh, this man, Moreno, is a special coach. What, what do you, playing under him, what can you say about him? It's a special man, like, that's his name, you know, the special one, yeah, very, very special. He teaches you, like, yeah. He's a good teacher, let me say that way, yeah? yeah. Good teacher, yeah. He's good, yeah? You, still, you miss him? A lot. But do you, do you still get him? Yeah, yeah, we talk, we talk sometimes. Okay. You'll be there, he said, Afina, come and style. Hugs. I said, okay, I'm good, yeah. Just asking you yeah, how yeah, you're yeah, doing. So he yeah. still keeps in touch. Yeah, yeah, yeah we yeah, talk every time. Checking yeah. how yeah. things are going. Yeah. Yeah. But then uh, come to that picture that we saw with you, Tuado, going everywhere, the circulation, and finally, you see, are coming to play for the national team. How was the feeling? Was it greater than the general game or? You know, before I didn't want to come for the national team because I wasn't like ready, let me say that way. But then like I had to. Yeah, so I spoke to Mourinho, he said, go do your best. I said, okay, thank you. Then I came here with, you know, anger in me. So yeah, then you guys said, I had a good game, so thank you. Yeah, two good games. <laughs> thank yeah, you guys. Like the what inputs it, say, if Derek Barton is a scout for Right to Dream and a top former Ghana star, just recently said in an interview that if we watch games, then that guy referring to you said you are largely responsible for our qualification, not the one final boy. Yeah, I remember when I went back to Roma, Monyo called me in front of my teammates. Yeah. 
So you see this guy? He run like, you know, like animal. Yeah. Alone, he press everybody. Yeah. If you don't do this here, I'll kill you. So he wanted you to do what you did yes. against Nigeria. Yeah. But I know it's a Rome Stadium is big, yeah. Genoa Stadium is big, but what I saw in Kumase and I was in Abuja, after the game and they wanted to beat us. I have never seen the crowd in Abuja like how do you like as a youngster maybe this is the second or third time you are playing in such a how do you soak up the the, the pressure? You know, I made my mind like Ghana is Ghana. That's a, I was born here, I'm from here so I need to die for them, you know, so yeah. give everything mm -hmm. I, I have. Because I yeah. I remember the two players, centre backs from Nigeria, one at German Bully, two top guys and then running to them everywhere. I don't know, was it a tactical idea say you have to run to them, pressure them and I say you, you know, know get hungry. I wouldn't say I wouldn't say tactical but it's a thing in me, you know. Yeah. That's my power. It's part of my power, you know, like I need to press. Yeah, so yeah. yeah. That was it. Right. Yeah, so that's now the future. We don't know. You have um, a club side to think of, and uh, your, your national team career is still 20. And I don't know what you have to say to your mentor, uh, Masamoja, who retired and still believe that you are the next of kin to him. Yeah. In what you would tell him? I would say um, good luck to like his new life. Wish him like everything he wants. You know, yeah. That's yeah, all so I can say. You are, you are, you are 20, and there is a lot to look at. What should fans of Fenijan? I don't know if you really know the kind of fans you have for just two or three games in the national team, and when you go everywhere, and people mention, and it's easy for you to have your name as a household name in Ghana. What is the plan? What should the fans look out for? From I won't say much on this. Like what I would say is, they should keep supporting me and still keep praying for me and i know things will change and they will see like more of me you know yeah so they should keep supporting okay. and i do appreciate them a lot yeah right but i think that uh, you have other kids in this region yeah. and beyond you saw what the love they showed today what would you tell them the route or route you took to give the way hard work then I'll be catch up if anybody wants to become like Yeah. What I would say is they should keep working hard, respectful, yeah, and keep on praying to God, you know, because God is answer for everything, yeah. So they should keep working hard and keep their prayers, you know, yeah. yeah. And finally, I would want you uh, to, if there is clarity, people have in their minds now if there is something you want to clear um, about the say Afanajan or so what more can I be? Is that true? That's not the fact but let's see what the future tells you. Yeah? From from your management point of view, let's see what they, they decide. But that's not the fact. No. Afana has not rejected no. the on board for no. Ghana. So, we are on post. We are on post. <laughs> to, re to rediscover yourself. Right. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay. Welcome.